Sunlight set up in Gratisolia district a team of skilled retirees who are able to offer local primary schools and to their municipality managed summer camps. Daily service has taken to follow the children in a set of sport activities organized in properly equipped local parks. This is Paola, the summer camp responsible for their primary school in Milan. She is telling the pupils the great news about sunlight. Every afternoon, all the children will get out of school to practice sports in properly equipped local parks. Vittore, a retiree of the Gratisola district, is the coach of the Pedibus and belongs to the first aid services. Jay Feng, a coach in a local sports association, coordinates basketball, football and volleyball. Viviana, student of educational sciences, is responsible for welcome activities. This is one of the public parks equipped by the municipality of Milan, where Jay Feng coaches a class for final tournament. Rocco hurts his knees while playing. Daniela from the first aid staff medicates him. In a nearby playground, Giada, one of the beginners, is practicing with Vittoria the basics of basketball. Afterwards, she'll be able to play with all the others. One, two, three, four, and ha! Everyone is ready for the final event of Sunlight Camp, where youngsters and retirees enjoy the victory. How to describe to the Sunlight Camp? The Guatasolio Primary School offers the parents a possibility to subscribe to the Sunlight Association. That will allow them to receive a discount for the Sunlight Camp fee. Otherwise, the children can subscribe directly to the camp. This fee will be defined according to the number of sports to be practiced and the period of participation. If brothers and sisters participate in the camp, they will have an extra discount on the fee. The retirees of the district can give their contribution, subscribing to the association paying a low annual fee they will receive back the opportunity to participate in different training courses. How is the training of the Sunlight staff? Parents and retirees of the districts which decide to subscribe to the association, they can attend different courses to become members of Sunlight staff. Vittoria and Daniela decide to attend first aid courses. Moreover, they attend a course to learn and practice the basics of basketball to become basketball referees. The members can decide how much time they dedicate to the camp and they will receive a monthly payback. The know-how acquired during the courses can be used during all the year, helping local associations during sport activities. Why is the service sustainable? Socio-ethical sustainability improves social cohesion. The service being offered to primary school children and their parents being based on a collaborative network of local inhabitants, particularly pensioners with a higher time availability, fosters social cohesion and particularly intergenerational dialogue empower valorized local resources. This service valorizes the local and administration offered to public schools for summer camps, when parents usually are engaged with their working activities. The activities valorize the local parks properly equipped with an innovative use. Environmental sustainability, responsible and sustainable consumption. The walking bus service, the Petty Bus, promotes a sustainable local mobility. Use intensification. The service simply existing local parks reduces the need to build additional infrastructures for sports. Transport reduction. The community walking bus service to reach the bus reduces the environmental impact of local mobility. Economic sustainability. Market position and competitiveness and added value for customers. Throughout the involvement of known and highly committed local people, the service is providing a rich, qualitative and trustful offer with a lower price when compared to those of private summer camps.